So you are going to open your YouTube Studio app and once you open it, click on this plus icon right here. Now select the video you want to upload. This is mine right here and it's going to load like this. The first thing we want to do is to change this video thumbnail. So click here. So right where it says change, click on it and you are going to select your thumbnail. This is my thumbnail right here and you click on select right up here. The next thing we want to do is to write a good title for our video. So I'll go ahead and write my title. You can go ahead and do yours. After writing your title, you want to make sure you add a description to your video. Now click on add description and I'm going to paste my description here and I will adjust it nicely. Go ahead and do yours as well. And once you are done with all your adjustments, click here to go back. The next thing we want to do is to set our video visibility. So click on visibility. If yours is not on public, change it to public. Go back, click on altered content and you are going to select either yes or no if your video contain any of what they say above so once you are done from there you are going to click on short remix and you are going to click the one that is suitable for you i don't want my video to be remixed so i'll click on don't allow remixing then you go back and you are going to click on comment turn it on go back again you are going to click on add to playlist this is where you are going to pick if your video is made for kids or it's not made for kids so mine is not made for kids i will click on this one and after that go ahead and click on upload video it's right down here after clicking that your video is going to start uploading you can see it's loading here and once it's done loading see processing will begin shortly after that you wait for your video to be uploaded so you are going to open your youtube app again click on this your image to your right and you click on your videos and you can see the video has been uploaded successfully click on these three dotted icons and you are going to add your video to a specific playlist so click on save to playlist and you are going to select the playlist where you want to add it to if you don't have any click on this new playlist and you are going to create a new one if you don't have one but i have a playlist already so i will select the one the place i want to put my video which is this android and iphone function after that you are going to click outside so you go back a step to confirm if the video has been saved to your playlist and you click on your image right here click on playlist scroll to where the playlist is mine is under um android and iphone then you scroll down to where your video is it depends on how you arrange your videos so i'll scroll down and my video is right here we've added our video to the playlist successfully let's move to the next thing if you go back to your youtube studio app again and you are going to click on the video we just uploaded which is this one and you click on this icon that is like pen and right here this is where you can actually change your title your description you can change anything you want to change here even if you forget to add it to a playlist you can always do it here right here and the next thing you want to do is to add hashtags to this video so under these small options click on it and right up here i'll go ahead and add the hashtags after the hashtag i want to add this video to a specific category so i'm going to go ahead and click on category which is right here where you see how to and style click on it so you change your video category right here mine is under how to so i will change it back to how to now click on comment to allow people to comment under your video so you're going to turn it on if yours is off mine is on already and you're going to check this box box to show how many viewers like this video click on this drop down arrow to select if you want youtube to add a license to your video to prevent people from using your content and once you are done with all of this go back a step and you're going to click on save this way all the changes we made after the video has been uploaded will now be added to the previous ones we have already and now we have successfully uploaded our video if you find this video helpful please kindly subscribe like this video and also share with friends and family bye for now